Zoe Ball shares epic smash hits throwback with Louise Redknapp, Spice Girls and Aunt McPartland Zoe Ball delighted fans and celebrity pals on Wednesday morning by sharing a major, blast from the past, featuring Louise Redknapp, Aunt McPartland, Mel B and more Zoe Ball has taken a trip down memory lane and shared a major blast from the past with her fans online. The BBC Radio 2 breakfast show host took to Instagram this morning to kickstart the day with a bit of 1990s nostalgia. Mum of Two Zoe shared a star-studded cover of the now-defunct Smash Hits magazine from over 25 years ago with her 621,000 followers. Alongside Zoe, stars such as Louise Redknapp, Aunt McPartland and Boyzone singer Shane Lynch can be seen on the cover of the music magazine, with the issue dated as the 25th of September to the 8th of October 1996. Pop's coolest cats and their mum, the 50-year-old presenter captioned the epic throwback. Thanks at I am Richie Anderson for this gem hash 1996. At the time the issue was released, Zoe was an up-and-coming star in the music and TV industry in addition to just beginning her stint as host of Live and Kicking, the presenter was also a regular face on top of the pops, usually alternating her hosting duties with fellow presenters DJs Joe Wiley and Jane fans and famous faces couldn't get enough of Zoe's throwback on Wednesday morning and rushed to the comment section to reminisce. Ah used to love the lyrics to songs, sitting listening to the countdown on a Sunday on Radio 1 singing along, come fan quipped. Another wrote, Oh my gosh, I'm pretty sure I will have bought this. Others pointed out how strange it was to see Ant on the cover without his TV sidekick, Declan Donnelly. How weird does Ant look without Deck? one Instagram user remarked. Poor Deck must have been a blow to be told to stay home for this one, another joked. The Pussycat Dolls singer Ashley Roberts also commented on the retro cover, leaving a clapping hands emoji underneath the post. Zoe was one of the biggest names around during the Britpop era in the 1990s, regularly hitting the headlines alongside musicians and fellow presenters. Landing the Radio 1 breakfast show gig, the bubbly presenter and her female peers, including pal Sarah Cox, were labeled Ledettes, thanks to their love of drinking and partying. Speaking in 2019, the former Strictly, It Takes Two presenter reflected on her wild, younger years and how times have changed since. To be honest with you, I think you try to live up to that, I don't think actually it was as rock and roll as we professed it to be, she told Huffington Post when discussing the Ledette label. But 20 years on, you're mums, you've been working, you've learned a lot, you're at a different point in your life. I'm nearly 50, you've got to grow up at some point, she added. I'm such a different person to the one I was at Radio 1, and I like to think that women are treated slightly differently to back then. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel and press bell icon button for more videos.